Hi, I'm Nora St. John from Balanced Body. And we're continuing on to segment three of our Active Office series. This segment we're going to look at trying to strengthen the upper back to go into extension. And the whole point of this is to combat the tendency to slump that you can often get into if you sit at a desk all day. This is a simple series. We'll show these sitting in your chair. Uh, that's usually where I would do these. You can also do them against a wall, and some of it can even be done on the floor. We'll start here with the roller. Again, our favorite tool for the moment, either a hole or a half. I'm going to put it right behind me. And it's just going to rest on the arms of the chair. So this will be in a different position depending on what kind of chair you have. I want this as low as I can get it to start. And here, hands just relaxed on the legs. I want to work on going from flexion. So I'm going to exhale and just press gently into the roller. And then inhale and extend slightly, meaning I'm looking up toward the ceiling. And then exhale and up. Gently mobilizing the spine, meaning I'm creating a little bit of mobility or movement in the vertebra. And also just starting to get some movement into that back space, into that extension space. Now, take three or four reps. That was probably five or six. We'll move up just a bit. So I'm moving about halfway up I'm between my waist and my shoulder blades. Same idea. Again, on the exhale, I'm pressing into the roller. And then on the inhale, I'm lifting up. Still keeping the roller against my back, creating a nice amount of movement in the spine. Last one. Now we move up to now just right below the shoulder blades. And this is a place where you want to focus on really getting the upper back to start to work. The chest opening that we did in the previous sequence is what often allows you to have the range of motion to start to strengthen and stretch this upper body. Last but not least, we'll take the roller out. Notice I just went to about the bottom of my shoulder blades there. I didn't go up onto my shoulder blades. You can if you like, but I find it more comfortable to stop just at the bottom. Now, holding onto the bottom of your chair, We'll take the same thing, but with a little pull. So I'm pulling into the chair, sliding my shoulder blades down, lifting my chest up. That's going to be my extension. So I'm going to inhale, and then exhale, and round. Inhale, and trying to stay nice and tall, bringing my chest forward. Notice that my head is only moving as much as my spine will allow. I'm not looking at the ceiling. I'm more looking at the corner of the room, depending on how high your ceiling is. After that sequence, I feel nice and tall. I can sit up a little bit better. My back muscles are awake, so they're helping to support me against gravity and decrease that slump. So there is section three, working on thoracic extension.